everyone my name is chatana and i am presented here along with my two teammates jyoti and sanu so we three are going to cover up the topic structure and union so in this we are going to discuss these three topics a structure explanation with syntax union explanation with syntax and their major differences so without wasting any time i would like to call sanu to come here and start explaining what is structure Good morning, everyone. My name is Shanu Kumar, and uh, I am going to explain uh, what is a structure. A structure is a user-defined data type, and uh, structure provides a facility to organize data as per our requirement. And structure contains similar and dissimilar types of data. And third, the structure is defined by the struct keyword. Now we are moving to the syntax and the example of the structure. Here we can see the syntax of the structure. First, we have write struct and the name of the structure. After that, we have uh, written data type and the variable. In the example the structure, we have created a structure called uh, student in which we are going to store roll number of the student and the uh, second is uh, name of the student. In a structure, we use a uh, type depth keyword in which provide that uh, type depth provide the facility to. Make our program more readable and avoid the uh, repetition of the structure. For the next slide, we are, I would like to invite uh, Jyoti. Good morning to all. I am Jyoti Jain, and I am going to be discuss discussing about union. So union is also similar like a structure, but uh, it has a major difference. Uh, union is similar like a structure. Union is used for data organization as a structure. Union is also user defined data type, and union can be defined using union keyword. Here is the syntax of union. Uh, where first of all we have to write the keyword union. After that we have to give the name of data type, and uh, in the curly braces we can define very various types of data types like integer, correct uh, or character. Here is an example where I have used the keyword union. After that, I have given the name to the data type student, and I have defined the integer uh, data type with variable roll and uh, character uh, data type variable name name with 20 sides. And in C programming, uh, union provides the facility to. Uh, Sort the user defined data type name with the help of keyword type def. Why, uh, when we write type def, uh, uh, after writing type def, we have to use the keyword union and the name of the data type. Uh, type def provides the facility to when uh, we use this user defined data type for declaring variable, instead of writing always union student. We can only write n and we can declare the variable. The differences will be uh, presented by the Chetanya. So, as you all seen the definition of a structure and union, now I'm going to discuss the major differences. So, union allocates memory as per its highest data among the all defined data, and all the data will share the same memory. But in the other hand, a structure allocates memory according to each variable declaration, declaration separately. Let me make it easier for you to explain by showing you an example. So as you can see in a structure, we declare an integer data type role. The space of integer data type is 4 and we, and we give character data type is space 20. So as you can see role and name both are declared separately. So the total memory allocated is 24. But in the other hand, the union, in union the space of character data type is greater than the space of integer data type. So all the memory will be allocated in the name data type. So in here, the total memory allocated is 20. Thank you.